Hi everyone, it's Jen from Happily Organized Chaos and I have a grocery haul for you. Um, this is a New Year Weight Watchers version grocery haul. I am following back on the Smart Point plan just to kind of kickstart my year, get back into healthy eating and making the right food choices to um, fuel my body, I guess. So I am going to jump right in and show you everything that I picked up. I went to Walmart today and I spent about $104, but I also bought tights for Madeline. So you'll see where the money went. It's a lot of um, fresh uh, produce and um, meats. So I'm going to flip the camera around and let you have a look. Okay, so this is what I picked up and I did my best to figure out the smart point value for each item. Um, like if... If you're familiar with my channel, you know I do not attend meetings for Weight Watchers, but I use an online calculator, and um, if I remember, I'll leave it linked down below. Anyway, I figured out the smart point value for everything that I would personally use. Some of the kids' stuff I didn't, so here I go. Um, unsweetened almond milk, the original kind. This here, I believe... I didn't figure this out, but I do drink it, um, is one smart point for a cup, but it's zero if you use half a cup. Um, I will insert right here uh, the smart point value. Um, this is Simply White Egg Whites. It's, I usually buy the smaller containers. I can have a quarter of a cup for zero. It's just egg whites. The, uh, they didn't have any Dempster's Thin Bread, but they did have this Weight Watchers Bread. I'm hoping it's okay. It's one smart point per slice. This granola, I wanted something, and I didn't have a calculator with me at the store. I was amazed. Seven smart points for half a cup probably will not be happening, but it's three smart points for a quarter of a cup, which is a little more reasonable uh, for breakfast. These here are multigrain sour cream and onion crisps. They are three smart points for, I believe it's 20 grams. Uh, yes, 20 grams are about 17 crackers. The chopped uh, Asian salad kit is my favorite salad. Four smart points for a one and a half um, cups. Carrots are zero, obviously. Pears are zero. Bananas are zero, um, and mushrooms, eggs. I saw this no sugar added jello pudding. It's two smart points for one container, and I thought I would try it out in case I wanted something uh, like dessert like. I'm not sure if I'm going to like it because it does, I think it does have an artificial sweetener. So I just, I stuck with one just to try. Um, apple sauces for the kids. Now, please let me know. I've heard a lot of um, other YouTubers say unsweetened applesauce is zero. This here is working out to three smart points because of the, I'm assuming it's because of the sugar levels. There's 11 grams of sugar in each of these applesauces. Um, so, I don't know. I won't eat them, probably. They're more for the kids, but... If they were zero, yeah, sure, I'd have one. But at three smart points, I'm not sure. But in any case, we have a raspberry cherry star fruit and two of the apple and pomegranate, which are the kids' favorites. Um, my plain fat-free Greek yogurt. It's one smart point for one of the containers. Um, Walmart's brand of Go Go Squeeze. I got an apple and a strawberry, and then I picked up this Mott Fruitsation plus veggies for the kids. Uh, chocolate chip dipped granola bars for them. Blueberries and cherry tomatoes. Frozen pineapple, because I'm going to make a smoothie. Strawberries, two cases. They looked okay and they were on for $1.99, which I thought was pretty a pretty good deal given the season. Um, this I am so happy I picked up. It's the Quebec Maple Ham Canadian Craft um, kind of like deli meat. 
It is ham with natural flavors and natural ingredients. It is made with real maple syrup. Um, the ingredients are just your pork, water, maple syrup, sugar, sea salt, vinegar, potato starch, cultured celery, and na natural maple flavor and spice. So there's what I really like to look for is the first three ingredients um, are they're natural. There's no like added um, refined uh, you know ingredients that we really can't name. And for six slices, it's only one smart point. So I am very excited to try that. I might actually have, uh, oh, I have leftovers I should eat. I don't know. I'll have to see. Uh, turkey kielbasa is, the, the kids love this. It's one smart point for 55 grams. Uh, two smart points for two slices of the uh, butterball bacon style turkey. So I'm thinking I'm going to make up some breakfast sandwiches um, for the freezer. This was on sale and clearance for $3.56. It's just some beef strips, which are always good to have. And uh prime boneless skidless chicken breasts. This is this was on this was ten dollars and I thought the chicken breasts actually looked really good. So that is everything that I picked up. Um, my order came to 104, but I also got Madeline a pair of uh, two pairs of tights for ballet and they were six dollars. So, this is everything that I picked up from Walmart. And yeah, and I shopped at Walmart if you haven't uh, already figured that out. Okay, so that is everything for my grocery haul. I want to thank you all so much for watching. If you haven't already, please remember to hit that red subscribe button down below to like and comment. And we will see you all again next week for another grocery haul. I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye, everyone.